Our last speaker, Melissa McCleary, a current student and a member of the Sexual Assault and Sexual Harassment Task Force, would like to discuss how to maintain focus on the issue moving forward. Thank you. My name is Melissa. Thanks for having me here today. The report of the Sexual Assault and Sexual Harassment Task Force demonstrated for the university community the extensive scope of the problem of sexual violence at Penn State. Statistically speaking, with a reporting rate for sexual assault of about 10% and over 20 assaults reported so far this academic year, there are hundreds of survivors of sexual assault at Penn State who deserve to have their stories heard and their experiences recognized. I hope the board completely and fully, fully acknowledges the extent of this problem. For anyone to deny it is a, a disservice and insult to those survivors and shows a misunderstanding of student life. I have been disappointed in the actions of some board members in response to this issue. I was particularly upset about a trustee who rolled their eyes at the January presentation of the task force and later refused to apologize for it. I have never in my life felt so disrespected and insulted by another human being. However, I've also dealt with trustees who are activists against domestic violence and who have asked pointed and intelligent questions about what the board can do to address this type of violence at Penn State. I want those people running my university. I encourage all board members to follow their examples. As a student who was on this task force and worked hard for 14 weeks for two hours at 7.30 in the morning, I can attest to the extreme importance of this report. The issue of sexual misconduct is important to the university and higher ed as a whole, most importantly because it has profound human cost. I ask the board to maintain strict focus on ending sexual violence at Penn State. Read our task force report in full. Ask questions, have discussions, and help Dr. Barron in implementing the task force's 18 recommendations. Help us ensure that Penn State is a leader in taking action against ending against these deplorable crimes. Anything less is unacceptable. Thank you. On behalf of the board, thank you all for taking the time to come to Hearst.